I'm welcome to Tisa Karaoke. Please subscribe down below on my channel at the I button and a lot. Today we are going to study about how can I objectively know whether I am intelligent? How can I objectively know whether I am intelligent? Number one, you are understand stuff that has a reputation for being hard to understand. Uh, you are sometimes confused why that stuff has that reputation. You understand stuff that has a reputation for being hard to understand and, and you are sometimes confused why that stuff has that reputation. Number two, you might have a good memory but you don't do a lot of memorization. Instead, you have information at your fingertips because you understand where that information comes from. You might have a good memory but you don't you do, don't do a lot of memorization instead you have information at your fingertips be, be, because you understand where that information comes from number three you solve problem quickly and your solution have a reasonable level of completeness you solve problem quickly and your solution have a reasonable level of completeness number four you solve problems slowly but with much greater depth than other people in similar circumstances you solve problems slowly but with much greater depth than other people in similar circumstances number five it takes a lot to arrive at a conclusion you notice that some people might confidently say that such a such is obvious but it's not obvious to you it takes a lot to arrive at a conclusion you notice that some people might confidently say that such a such is obvious but it's not obvious to you number six however you do it you like solving hard problem at least sometimes however you do it you like to solve hard problem at least sometimes. Number seven, you often find yourself, at least often prefer to find your, yourself listening rather than talking in a conversation. You often find yourself, at least often prefer to find yourself listening rather than talking in a conversation. Number eight, you have intellectual curiosity about some stuff that other regard as intricate or akin. You have intellectual curiosity about some stuff that other regard as intricate or arcane. Number nine, you are unafraid to ask questions when you don't understand something and you ask those questions unapologetically. You are unafraid to ask questions when you don't understand something and you ask this question unapologetically. Number ten, this one might be a little confusing controversial but you have at least a little a bit of you humility for sure these are excep exceptions but by a uh, day mm -hmm. most intelligent people i have met are sensitive to how little they understand about the world not how much they understand the world please subscribe down below on my channel at the able to learn a lot today we have talked about how can i objectively know whether i am intelligent how can i objectively know whether i am intelligent bye subscribe on my channel at the able to learn a lot bye